Hi Gemini, this is my Shima Shashtaloka. Let's see what is your situation as of now and what you need to hear from me. Gemini is out there, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What is it that you need to hear from me? Just one more time. All right. Gemini is out there. What is it that you need to hear from me right now? Your first card is the Eight of Swords. There is a sense about being a little helpless, not knowing what needs to be done to get out of the situation. Okay, being stuck. Seems like you're trapped. The sense of feeling trapped uh, because, you know, there are others in the picture who wants things to be done in a different way and uh, you don't know what you know what else to do okay there is a sense of being helpless up here and the way how you can make things work some of you might be dealing with a capricorn energy and speaking to the gemini some of you might be dealing with another gemini all right not knowing what needs to be done to make things work. What else? Ooh, that's your next card. King of Wands. Yes, some of you are hiding. And I feel like there are others in the picture. Multiple people energy. It could be a family situation as well. Either you are hurting or there are others who are hurting because of you and they don't know what needs to be done. It seems like uh, somebody has to make a decision in regards to a situation. Moving forward. Like, uh, you know, um, A strategy how we can go forward in the future and somebody needs to make that decision they're still contemplating they have no idea what needs to be done how to make it work like I feel like you're stuck in between two other people and both have different views and you want to uh, you know make it work or balance with these people it's almost like i want to say i just want to say okay you're married and you have a new wife and there is your mother okay they don't see eye to eye just an example they don't see eye to eye who are we speaking to gemini <laughs> all right um and you have to you know both are dear to you but still You have to favor both. So how do you make it work? If you favor your wife, it is not going to go well with your mother. If you favor your mother, it is not going to go well with your wife. So you are stuck in between. That's the kind of energy which I'm getting out of your reading. You're stuck. You're hurting and you don't want to hurt them. So you need to be very determined to make this work all right yeah to make everybody happy and I feel like it's a uh, it's a family situation could be a work situation as well some of you might be dealing with a Cancerian or a Leo a Libran or probably a Pisces could have put that back Gemini is out there what is your next card, please? Your next card is the Two of Cups and the Five of Cups. So it's it's like there is so much disappointments, you know, crying over spilled milk. You join hands with someone, somebody is hurt. Okay, and you just don't know what needs to be done to make things right between the two parties. And I feel like there is more than two parties. 
but you have to make it um, yeah balanced between each and every party you're involved with some of you might be yes so you know the wheel will keep turning now you're not stuck you want to take things forward you want to keep things rolling you want to bring back uh, or you want to bring that balance within the relationships okay interesting uh, yeah In some of your cases, a father figure is very disappointed. Or you might be the uh, emperor who is very disappointed with, you know, the spilt milk, with what has been lost. All right. Gemini is out there. What is your next card, please? This one. Six of Pentacles. And the Three of Wands. Somebody is still trying to initiate even though the response is pretty much uh, restricted, you're not getting the, you know, equal response. There is an imbalance, but you are trying. You are trying to bring things around. You are trying to make things right. Like I said, you are trying to make things balanced. Okay. So you you will uh, initiate. Okay. To bring about that balance even though there are so much disappointments even though you are stuck in between you are still going to try to make things right I, I want to keep saying balance okay somebody is trying to balance things even if you look at this card it's interesting uh, there is this person who is you now holding on to this wing scale so, and um, yeah, funny, um, this person has two people who is extending their hands and the story which I told you about the mother and the daughter-in-law and you are stuck in between, it's like you have to weigh the scale to give each person equally. If you give a little more this side, then that uh, the other person is going to be pissed, okay? It's almost like they will blame you for taking sides. So you are stuck. I don't know for who this is, but this is how it's coming through. Okay? Because in the center of the reading is the Two of Cups. It speaks about relationships, commitments, no? the bonding. But then there is this energy about balancing things out. You're doing this so that things will come around. Okay, so that, uh, you know, your plan works out. Things go according to your plan. Mm -hmm. So there is no disruption. Some of you might be dealing with a Taurus or probably an Aries. All right, Gemini is out there. What is your last card, please? This one? The Sun card. Along with the Three of Pentacles. Um, I feel like things will change, okay? Things will get better. Even though you feel stuck right now, you feel trapped right now, feels like, you know, things are not going anywhere. You know, you're banging your head on a brick wall, but things will get better because the last ending card is a sun card, which is, uh, you know, the most beautiful positive card in this deck. And again, in this picture, if you see, there is three people. Again, there is one person who is, you know, well, who is somehow superior to the other two. This is a person, like, you know, mentoring the others. And in the same case as the Six of Pentacles, there is one person above the other two. So it feels like you have to handle the situation very uh, cautiously. Yeah, to give equally, there is a need to make that uh, balanced or, you know, make that dynamic work. I hope that makes sense. 
I hope it makes sense to each and every one of you because I feel like this is for somebody out there. Because I see in a couple of cards, the story which I was trying to convey, it's coming out in a couple of cards. So if you're struggling right now, if you feel like, you know, it's not going to go anywhere, this is just going to be a nightmare, things will get better. You will be able to make things right between uh, the other two people who is not on the same page. Okay? Just, just keep trying. Okay? Some of you might be dealing with a Capricorn energy or that's it. Or maybe a Leo. That's it for now. This is Marishi, you want to channel for Luca. Until next time, bye.